right, good morning. Okay, today for our workout, we're gonna do, let's start getting warmed up. I can talk and get you guys warmed up at the same time. Okay, so today we're gonna do a little bit more um, cardio, kind of high intensity training um, for the workout. It's probably be a little bit shorter um, than our normal 40 minute workouts. And that's because the intensity, you're probably gonna be breathing pretty hard and it's gonna be close to non-stop. The only time I'll stop is we have some 30 second breaks in between some sets where I can explain the exercises. But other than that, it's gonna be long sets, okay? We're gonna use the Tabata, okay, let's reach up. We're gonna use that format. If you used to go to my HIT classes, you know that format of the 20 seconds on, 10 seconds break, and then we do that for four minutes. Um, now, a true Tabata workout is literally only four minutes long. We're using the interval timing um, just to keep that, um, let's see, the timing variation. But we're gonna do multiple uh, rounds of that, or at least two, okay? Two rounds of the four minute sets. So our heart rates are gonna be up pretty high. Um, so I want you to work within your limits. You know, uh, I'll show everyone modifications. Okay, body weight, easy body weight squats. Just a little bit here, like a quarter squat. Getting those legs moving. So we're gonna be breathing pretty heavy today. So now if you don't wanna breathe that hard, just slow everything down and use the modifications. All right, I want you to make it work for you. Okay, <laughs> I need this workout. Last night, my kids, who are teenagers, were just like, oh my goodness. It was like a perfect night. You know, they're like playing their video games together and they're laughing and having a good old time. And I'm like, oh, I'm such an amazing mom. Look at my kids. They're so great. They love each other, right? Next day, I'm getting ready to get this to come down here and do this workout. And I just hear them bickering at each other. And I am just like, Please stop. So I went from feeling like, oh, everything's wonderful <laughs> to frustration. So anyway, this will be a good workout for me because, you know, you get rid of some of that stress of just ah, parenting. So anyway, so this will make me feel better. I hope it makes you feel better get our minds in a good place, help us focus on something for ourselves, for our bodies, okay? That's good, we need that right now. Encourage one another. Okay, now we're gonna go back to those easy body weight squats. Little quarter squats, that just means you don't go all the way down, okay? Getting those legs warmed up. Oh. Yes, so hopefully your day is going well. I think we're on like the 50th day of raining nonstop. <laughs> okay, maybe not, it feels like it. So I could use some sunshine, some vitamin D, so hopefully tomorrow there'll be some sun, we'll see. <laughs> Whew. Okay, I'm already starting to feel better. Getting the blood flow, starting to relax a little bit. My breathing's actually starting to calm down a little bit. Okay, let's do one more time, punching, reaching, and squatting. Last round, and then we'll start the workout. Let's see how much time we got. Yeah, that'll be about five minutes, perfect. So I hope you guys are good. <laughs> I hope your kids are getting along. I hope they're like, oh yes, we love each other. <laughs> All locked up in the same house. Whew, we got this. We got this, moms. We got this, moms and dads. <laughs> uh, and pet parents, your babies are loving this. They're just like, take me on more walks. I love this. I'm so happy. <sighs> we all have our challenges. Okay. So our first round, we're going to do squat jumps, and then we're going to do push-ups. We're going to alternate those two things 20 seconds on, you get a 10 second break, and then you go to the next one. And you'll see the pattern, and we do eight rounds total.
total four rounds of each of the exercise. All right. Okay, last time, little body weight squats. So the jump squats that we're gonna be doing, um, I kind of give you a break in the middle. You bring your feet together, you jump wide, and then you bring your feet back together. I'll, I'll demonstrate. Now, if that's a little much for you, the modification for the squats is this body weight squat, okay? You can work with your bod, go as low as you want. You can keep it low, you can keep it shallow, whatever works for you for that 20 seconds. And for the push-ups, you can go knees or toes for the push-ups. And another thing you can do is you can go fast or you can push up, hold it. Push up, hold it, because we got 20 seconds. Okay, so I'm not sure how many you're gonna get. It's all individual, okay? All right, so here we go. We're starting our first round. Let me get my mat ready. I'm gonna do the jump squats. Oh, I guess I'll do push-ups this way so I don't have to mess with my mat too much, okay? I'll be doing push-ups on my toes. If I get tired, I'll drop to my knees, all right? Okay, guys. All right, so first thing, 20 seconds of these, jump squats wide together. This gives you a little break. All right, so we're gonna go 20 seconds those. 10 second break, which will give you enough time to go down to the mat and then hit your push ups. Okay, on your knees or your toes, whatever works for you. Eight rounds, four sets of each of these. Okay, got Sarge here ready to time us. And here we go. Go. So, whatever pace you want to go for these is good. Just make it work for your body. If you want to start out slower because you don't feel quite warmed up, go ahead and start out with some body weight squats. All right? All right, 20 seconds. Good, stop. Let's get ready for our push ups. We only got 10 seconds. Three, two, one. Here we go push ups. 20 seconds of push ups, guys. You can pause in between your push ups. Try to figure out how many you can do before the break. And break. 10 second break. Oh, back to the jump squats. Oh, baby. Ready, steady, go. Here we go. 20 seconds of these babies. Again, if you want to do regular squats without the jump, that's what you do, okay? Just make sure you're breathing. We're almost there, one more. Break, back to push-ups. Now, if you wanna alternate, you now do some knee push-ups. I'll do a set of knee push-ups. Shave with the leg back, go! Here we go, down and up, just on your knees. Nice, straight line. Keep your head up, bring your chest down to the mat. And break, all right. We are halfway there. Get ready for those jump squats. Go. Here we go back to the jump squats or a regular squat. Body weight squat, whatever works for you. I'm gonna go back to my push-ups on my toes next. You can keep it on your knees or on your toes. Break. If you don't wanna do any more push-ups, hold a plank, okay? Whew. And go. Remember, you can rest in between, and so you don't have to do as many for the 20 seconds. And break. Oh man, guys, one more of each, okay? Last time, jump squats. And go. Whoo, baby, last time with these, okay? One 
Almost there. Break. All right. Here we go. Last time, push-ups or plank, knees or toes. Whichever works best for you. Last 20 seconds, guys. Go. And break. All right. Okay, so that was based on the Tabata 20 seconds on, 10 seconds break, four minutes round. Okay, next. While you catch your breath, get a drink, we're gonna do another four minute set. But this time we're gonna alternate burpees and plank jacks. Starting with burpees, let me show you the modifications. Full burpee, hardest one, okay? Hardest one to do, you see me there? I'm gonna move this forward. Okay, hardest one, you're gonna bring your hands down to the mat. You're gonna go into a squat, you're gonna jump your legs out, hands below your shoulders, jump them out, then you're gonna jump your feet wide and come up. Now we just did the push-ups with the um, last set, so don't bother doing the push-ups with the burpees. Normally a full burpee, you do a push-up, take that out. If you want, you can do a jump though, okay? So a full, full version with no push-up, and jump, okay? If that's too much for you, I want you to back it down a little bit, and you're just gonna bring it out. You're gonna jump out, jump in, and stand up, okay? Squat thrust. Last one, if that's too much for you, hands down. You're just gonna step it back, step the other leg back. Step in, step in, and bring it up, okay? So it's like this. And bring it up, okay? So pick one of those that you want, all right? For the first, for the burpees. Now, for plank jacks. This is easy, you're gonna hold a plank, and jump your legs out and together. Looks like this. You need to go plank, you're just jumping out together, your feet growing out together. Okay, modification for this you can just step it out. Okay, even more, hold a plank. Okay, if you don't want to, even, if you want to just keep it here and not move on your knees, on your hands. Okay, and you decide which one you want to do. All right. I think I'm gonna go ahead and move my mat this way. For this one, I could be at the back of the mat. All right, cool. All right, guys, ready? Four minutes. Starting with the burpees. Ready? Pick your variation and go. Here we go. Remember, you don't have to do the push-up. We just did push-ups. And break. All right. Next, we're doing the plank jack. Plank, legs out and together. Ready, go. So just out, together. Out, together. Okay? That's what we're doing. Hopefully, you can see that. Modification is just step it out, out, in, in, okay? And break. Oh. Going back to those burpees. Pick your variation, tuck my shirt in, go. Remember it? 
Knees or toes. Whew. These are tough. I haven't done it for a long time. Break. Halfway there, guys. Two minutes in. Oh, baby. Okay, ready? Go. Burpees. Burpees, burpees. Woo. Switching up the timing pattern. Instead of the 20, 10, it's now gonna be 30 seconds of speed skaters. Remember these guys, 30 seconds of these. Now, you can hop or you can just take it here, okay? Curtsy or a speed skater, okay? If you want to add a little bit more high intensity, get your heart rate up, you get a little jump in there, okay? So have 30 seconds of that, then with no break, we're going into side-to-side -side hops. Full version of the side-to-side -side hop. Pretty easy, we're just gonna jump side-to-side. -side. Okay, that's it. Just keep the heart rate up. Now, if you can't do that, I want you to do this. Okay, one leg hop, hop. Hop. All right? And if for some reason you have a problem with this, your knees hurt or something, just step, 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 step. So you're gonna make it your own. First round. Speed skaters, side to side hop. And one more thing I wanna show you before we get into this because we're going from one thing to another is seal jacks. It's the last thing we're gonna be adding in here. Okay, start with your hands here, legs together. Here we go here, together. Just jump it out and together. Now, you wanna try, if that's a little much for you, step out, together, out, together, okay? That's seal jacks. When I say seal jacks, you're doing this one, this one, or the hardest one is to do a seal jack and do a squat, okay? So you're gonna choose which one you want, 30 seconds for that too. All right, so speed skaters, every time we're gonna do these minutes, we're gonna alternate between speed skaters, or sorry, we're gonna keep speed skaters, we're gonna go side to side hops, and then we're gonna do the seal jacks. And then we're not taking a break, we get a little break in between these one minute sets. So you guys ready again? Let me get my stopwatch ready. Starting with speed skaters, 30 seconds, then we're going into side to side hops. Then we get a break. 30, 30, break. All right, go. 
Remember, you do this one that you want. It works for your body, okay? So you're hopping or taking the hop out of it. You can go as fast as you want. Like, Dawn is gonna be just hauling in this one. She'll be like, pa, pa. Whew. I'm gonna do it at a medium pace with a hop. Whew. Almost there, we got five seconds. All right, now we're going right to the side to side hops. Okay, so hopping, both feet together. Or you could do the one. Okay? Whichever works for you. We got 30 seconds. 15 left. Almost here, guys. Five seconds. And break. All right. Little 30 second break right here. 30 second break. Now we're going to seal jacks. One of those and a speed skater. All right. So we're going to seal jacks and a speed skater. So for the seal jacks, here is one, two, and then into the squat is three. Okay. Seal jacks to start. And Go. So we're doing this for 30 seconds. So I'm gonna watch that so I can see. The form will be better if I'm not trying to look at a clock in my hand. Remember, you don't have to go into the squat. Almost there. We got five seconds. Then we're going right into speed skaters. And here we go, right into speed skaters. Now, if you have to slow it down, slow it down to here. Just to keep moving, all right? Make it work for you guys. Make it work for your own body. Ooh, legs are kind of tired after those seal jacks. 10 seconds. Ooh, baby. Three seconds. And break. Oh. Okay, 30 seconds break. And that's it. Okay, so now we're going into speed skaters first. And then back to the side to side hop. Speed skaters, then the side to side hop. All right. Almost there. Five seconds and then we're starting. Okay, ready? Speed skaters, go. Jumping as much as you want or as little as you want. You could go wider and keep it kind of narrow. You just keep staying frame here. We got five seconds, guys. Then we're going right into side to side hops. All right, here we go. Side to side hops. Remember modification? Step over, step over, or side to side. It's your choices. We're almost there, we got five seconds left. Then a 30 second break. Break. 30 second break. All right. Ooh, last round. Seal jacks. And then speed skaters. And then we're done with this set. Okay? Okay. 10 seconds. 10 seconds. Starting with the seal jacks and then the speed skaters. Last round. Go. Remember, whatever variation that works for you, work it, work it. <laughs> Almost there, guys. Five seconds, and we're going right into the speed skaters. Ooh. All right, here we 
we go. Speed scanners. Oh, hi legs. His legs are feeling it, huh? Oh, feels good. Feels good to get those muscles moving. We got to move it, move it. We got to move it, move it. 10 seconds, guys. Woo! Almost there. Three seconds. And break. Okay. We're done with that. All right. So, let our heart rate come down a little bit. Next, we're going to go into corkscrew. Let me teach that to you. Now, I usually, in my gym, I hold a weighted plate for this, like a 10 pound plate or something. But I know you guys probably don't have that, so we're gonna improvise. We're not gonna have to worry about weighting this exercise. It's about getting a rotational move, using our full body, get our heart rate up, okay? So you guys probably all have these. Let's go ahead and use wipes or something that you can hold on to Move it quickly through the air. So let me demonstrate. It's called the corkscrew. You're gonna hold something this way, this way, whatever you want, okay? You're gonna rotate, twist, let this heel come up. You're gonna squat down, bring this behind your foot. Can you see that? And then you're just gonna move it up and across your body as fast as you can. Now, just like that. Back into it, boom, boom. All right, and then we're gonna do the other side. Bring it here and across. Okay, here and across. Now, if that's a little much for you and you're pretty tired from this workout, I'm not gonna make it so explosive. You don't have to go so low. Bring it here to your knee and up and across. See, knee up and across. Knee, see my back, my feet are twisting. Make sure your feet are twisting, guys. It's important. You don't want your feet locked down on this one. See that? Same with this way. Boom. Moving your feet with this. So either go into your ankles or your knees. Last one, if that's still a little much for you, bring it here, press it up. Hip and up. Again, my feet are still moving with my body. That's important. We're doing three rounds of these, then we're stretching. Three rounds, 10 on each side, break, two more. Okay, so round one, pick your variation, get whatever you're holding, and let's go. Down and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay? Other side, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Break. Woo! Okay. We got two more rounds of that. Catch your breath. Now, that one, you're just moving as fast as you can, whatever modification you can. We got two more of these and then we get to stretch. It's a high intensity workout for the day. Watch this one as many times as you want. I don't know how many of these I'll put online. I like a lot of the strength stuff. All right, before we're full, we don't want to recover fully. So let's get back into it. Here we go. One, two, three. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Okay, other side. And one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Nine and ten. Break and we got one more. And then we're gonna stretch and cool down. Okay, if one is normal 
for one side to feel really good and be like, oh man, I got this, I'm awesome, right? It's your dominant side. The other side is probably like a little wonky and you're like, wait a second, this feels weird. <laughs> That's totally typical. We all have our dominant side. It's usually a little weaker, maybe not be so good with the nervous system. Just make it work, it'll get better. Train your nervous system, you'll always get better. That's what's so amazing about the body. Okay, ready? Last round, let's go. One, this is my good side. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Okay, my non-dominant side, here we go. This one's a little more difficult for me. Feels a little bit strange, but it's getting better. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and 10. Oh, thank you, wipes, <laughs> for a lot of reasons. Okay, all right, guys, we did it. That's it, we're gonna just cool down now. And stretch. Let our heart rate come down. So we're just gonna step side to side. Let the heart rate come down. Ooh, I hope you like that, guys. That was fun. Huh. I'm not stressed anymore. You probably aren't either. Okay, so letting the heart rate drop gently. Slowly, keep moving. We don't want to just sit down or stop moving. Our heart rate was pretty high. Let's bring it down gradually, okay? Okay, smaller steps. Heart rate's coming down. Do a little bit of shoulder rolls just because they feel good. I do a lot of torso twists and shoulder rolls. Make me feel good, relaxed. Heart rate's coming down. All right, I wrote out a bunch of workouts today. So, oh, cool, this is cool. Kimmy is gonna make you guys bracelets. If you get 25 workouts, you get a bracelet too. So every 10 workouts, you get a charm. 25 workouts, you get a bracelet from Kimmy. So it's pretty stinking awesome. I'll put a picture on Facebook for you guys. All right, I feel pretty good. I feel like my heart rate's down. Let's go ahead and stretch a little bit. I'm gonna put one leg forward and push my hips back. Feeling a little stretch in my hamstrings, okay? Yeah, so they're really cool bracelets. I don't have a picture of one, but I'll put it on Facebook. So 25 workouts, again, you know, I'm doing this till June, you have time to hit that goal. When you get to 10, let me know. I'll make you a little charm. Okay, other side. We call it like, uh, instead of 25, maybe we should have done 19 for COVID-19, huh? <laughs> maybe not. <laughs> yeah, so pretty good. We're all trying to support each other, keep each other positive. We're all challenged, guys. We wake up and it's, Whoa, yeah, another day of this, you know, I'm trying to talk to my kiddos and be like, you know, sometimes the kids, they don't quite understand why they're fussy. And I'm like, it's all right, man. It's okay if you're a little fussy, we'll just get, we're all feeling this way. So let's try our best to encourage one another and help each other when we're feeling low, right? Hopefully we're all in those little points in different places so we could encourage one another when we need it. I'm a total introvert. I know you guys don't believe that, but I am. And even I'm like struggling with not seeing anyone. <laughs> so, which is pretty funny because usually I could just be in my house all the time, but I'm like, wow. So if you get a text from me, it's because I'm truly missing you guys big time. All right, let's go to upper body. <sighs> okay, another side. Oh, I hope you guys like that one. So I'm gonna put this one as the high intensity interval training, the HIT workout. It's a little different than the other ones. 
You can do this one whenever you want to get your heart rate up, okay? The other stuff is more for strength, okay? This is to get your heart rate up. I mean, you get stronger with this too. You'll see yourself get to be able to do different variations. Okay, shoulder rolls. Torso twist. Okay, and we're almost done. Bring it back to center. Inhale, reach. Exhale, out two more times. And out. And last one. Uh, all right. Take care, guys. And um, I'll be doing more workouts soon. I got pretty sweaty. Do I got pits? Yeah, I do. Cool. Hope you do too. All right. Bye.